Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This video is on IC 12th important physics derivations. Now in this video, I am going to list the important derivations chapter wise. The first chapter is electric charges and fields. Now out of these three, you can expect any one. Intensity of the electric field at a point on axis of dipole. Intensity of the electric field on the equatorial line of dipole. Torque on a dipole in a uniform electric field. Now Gauss theorem. Electric field due to a point charge, infinite line of charge, infinite plane sheet of charge, two infinite parallel sheets of charge and uniformly charged thin spherical shell. For this you have three cases. External point at the surface at internal point and you must learn the graph also one word questions are also framed from this derivation and yes it's not important for you to prove a derivation with one method there are plenty of methods out of which you feel is the easiest you can go for that electric potential and potential energy now electric potential due to point charge electric dipole potential of axis of dipole and potential of equatorial line then electric field as gradient of electric potential that is the relation between e and v e is equal to minus dv by dr so uh, mostly they don't ask you to derive this they may ask you to write the relation between e and v work done in rotating an electric dipole in an electric field potential energy of an electric dipole in an electrostatic field redistribution of charges that is the common potential u minus u dash is equal to c1 c2 divided by 2 into c1 plus c2 v1 minus v2 whole square now you may expect this in numericals as well as the derivations you can practice this derivation for three to four times because it is a little bit complicated and students tend to ignore this derivation but it may also come capacitors and dielectrics parallel plate capacitance uh, it may be asked then if you insert an electric slab here dielectric slab then the derivation will be different battery connected battery disconnected what is the effect to capacitance voltage and all these terms it may be asked combination of capacitors in series and in parallel force between plates of charged parallel plate capacitors this is also an important derivation coming to electric resistance and ohm's law the relation between drift velocity and current that is i is equal to any avd this derivation may also come then derivation of ohm's law you must also do it in vector form combination of resistors that is in series and parallel now dc circuits and measurements combination of cell in series and parallel Kirchhoff's law you must do it because you can expect numericals from here next is Wheatstone bridge meter bridge potentiometer comparison of emfs of two cells then internal resistance of primary cell any derivation may come and you have to make a diagram also moving charges and magnetism magnetic field due to current carrying conductor that is biot savert law then magnetic field due to straight ca uh, current carrying conductor of finite size magnetic field that axis of current carrying loop circular that is a circular loop magnetic field at center of circular current carrying loop ampere circuital law this is really important magnetic field of long straight thin wire b is equal to mu naught divided by 2 pi into i by r force between two parallel current carrying conductors then torque on a current loop moving coil galvanometer you have to do only the suspended coil galvanometer current and voltage sensitivity these uh, formulas you have to learn both of these formulas conversion of galvanometer into ammeter and voltmeter then magnetic field and earth's magnetism for this you have to only learn the formulas of end on position broadside position and torque Magnetic classification of substances, it has no derivation, you just have to uh, learn the definitions there, like ferromagnetism and all these, these definitions. For electromagnetic induction, you have to do motional EMF, 
proof of faraday's law and self induction then comes alternating current you have to do all the circuits that i have mentioned here that is the circuit containing resistance only circuit containing inductance only capacitance only then lr circuit cr circuit lc circuit and lcr these circuits are also important for the numericals part then resonant circuits also electromagnetic waves you have to do only the spectrum the electromagnetic spectrum that is the gamma rays ultraviolet rays infrared rays and then it goes on and on to microwaves radio waves right you have to learn the properties of them the uh, how are they produced and then what are the uses of these radiations that is only to be learned here in part 2 i'll cover the important derivations of other chapters that are left out in this video and yes if you are new to my channel please subscribe thank you we got to keep it low key keep it softly spoken with no strings tying you to me I'm happy in your company with no emotion cuz my love deserves to be free. I never want to look at a house in the garden. I never want to lock you down. I know you're not mine. It's just my turn, but we can still have fun for now. Tell me you don't really do commitment trust me consider your message received when you said you couldn't take us too seriously i must admit i was relieved cuz i never want to play happy families with you but i like having you around i'm fully aware this is a flash in the pan but we can still have fun for now so much attention and when you're moving in another direction don't worry i get it i meant what i said when i said it lady i never want to look at a house in the garden i never want to lock you down i know you're not mine it's just my turn but we can still have fun for now No, I never want to play happy families with you, but I like having you around. I'm fully aware this is a flash in the pan, but we can still have fun for now.